Carlita, good night. Rosalba. Good night, teacher. Hi, Rosalba. Good night. Hi. How are you? Hi, thank you. And you? Sí, no le escuché. Oh, it's, it's stressful, but it was fine. And you? How was your day? Fine. Okay, casi, fine. Casi no le escuché. Ah, y ahorita. Ahorita sí. How was how was your day? Uh, working in office and home office. Oh, you work in your house. Yes. Like like me. <laughs> yes. But you know, it, sometimes it's a little different to work in your house than working in an office, right? Yes. Yeah, because in the house you have a, a lot of all your family with you. Muchas interrupciones. Yes. Well, in my case, uh, all my family is in the, in the bedrooms, so I don't have any problems. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Carlos. Hi, teacher. How are you, Carlos? Very nice. Did you finish the exercise? Uh, in the num number four. No, I hey. Yeah, yeah, excellent, Carlos. Very good, excellent. Carmen, we missed you. Hello. Hey, hello. Carmen. Good night. Good night. Uh, uh, yeah, amor, yeah. Gracias. <laughs> Edgar. Hello. Good night. Hi, Edgar. Good night. You, Hi. you are you in the beach right now? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yeah, your picture is very nice if you are in La Costa del Sol. Okay. Eran tiempos buenos. Ah, yeah. Tell me about that. Sí. Yeah. Okay. Uh, good night, Mario, Eduardo, and, and all people that I see there. Okay, so right now we're going to begin the class. Our, as always, we begin with a little presentation, all right? Can you see the presentation? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Now, um, I'm going to show you a, a picture. Okay. And this is a picture with free time activities. This is a picture with free time activities. So activities that we do uh, in our free time. Saturday, Sunday. Well, antes era así, right? Ahora we have time in the house. All right, very good. But we have free time activities. So let me see. I will need some volunteers to help me. Maybe Carmen Reyes help me. Okay. okay. <laughs> Hi, Carmen. All right. <laughs> okay. Can you can you please Carmen read uh, the the expressions that I'm gonna show? You? Let's begin with this. One. Watch TV. Okay. Listen to music. Yeah. Play an instrument. Perfect. And spend time with, me, with the family. Thank you, Carmen. Thank you very much. Okay, okay. I will need a different victim. Let me see. Uh -huh, Madi. <laughs> How are you, Madi? Good, good night. Fine. All right. Can you read the next expression, please? Okay, go to the movies. Read. Go shopping and go go out with friends. Okay, thank you very much. All right, thank you very much. Let me see, Sabdiel, are you there? Yeah, good night. Hi, good night. Sabdiel, I like your name because my son, my son's name is Abdiel. Ah, okay, casi igual. Yeah, almost similar. Okay, can you please read the following expressions? Sabdiel, are you there? Play video games. Okay. Surf the internet. Yeah. Do play soccer. 
sport. Uh -huh. Ah, do play sport, perdón. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And? Study. 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 Okay, thank you very much, Sabdiel. Okay, now here we have, uh, pay attention to this one, a donde dice do and play sports. Les voy a explicar la diferencia. I'm going to explain it because some students in the previous class. Okay, you're going to use the verb play when you play with a ball. Okay? okay. Todo deporte, all sport that you play with a ball is play. Tenemos excepciones. Of course, we have some exceptions. For example, play uh, chess, uh, etc. But when we have play, play soccer, play basketball, play golf, play badminton, play American football, okay, all that is a ball or you use a ball is play. And do. Okay. Yeah. And the verb do is when you use all your body. We use all the body, all right? For example, uh, do karate, karate, do karate, do exercise, okay? Do yoga. I don't know how you, you do yoga, right? But some people do yoga. That, uh, some people do yoga, all right? Do exercise, do yoga, do karate. Okay, all uh, the body is, is used. That is Teacher, the difference. Do swim? No. In that case, Carmina, we say go swimming. Go swimming, okay. Go. Mm -hmm. In that case, we use the verb go. Okay. And now in here we have different activities that we do in our free time. So please take a, a picture. Yes. from the from the activities you have the picture yes teacher thank you carlos yes. thank you and 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 i think other people too now i'm gonna erase this i'm gonna erase this and let's let's go to the next slide okay what we're gonna do right now we're gonna practice this question that is here what do you do in your free time? You answer, I watch TV, I listen to music, I do yoga, I do exercise. Fácil, fácil, fácil. A las expresiones que les enseñé, to the expressions I showed you. My story. I showed you. Solo le vamos a poner antes, I. It's clear? Yes. Okay. Yes. Eh, but um, there are some students, hay algunos alumnos, que les gusta mencionar el verbo like. Bye. Ahí ya vamos a cambiar un poquito eso. Si usted quiere usar like, entonces sería así. I like watching TV. Es una regla gramatical. All right. It is a grammar rule. Mm -hmm. I watch TV. And if you say, I like watching TV, no hay diferencia. There is no difference. Está diciendo lo mismo. You are saying the same, but in a different way, in a different form. It's clear? Yes. Yeah. So you can say, I listen to music, or you can say, I like listening. Ahí le ponemos el ING porque es una regla gramatical. Después del verbo like, all right, after the verb like. I'm going to use the verb in ING. So I like listening to music. Is it clear? Yes. Pero solo puede decir yes. I watch. Yes? Si vamos okay. a usar el like, significa que al verbo se le va a agregar el ING. Al que sigue. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. I will show you, Carlos. I will show you. Don't worry. Aquí han caído en buenas manos, que yo, I'm very patient, ¿ok? Yo, usted quiere preguntar, no tenga pena. You, you can ask the questions that you want. Ok, Carlos, for example, here we have go to the movies. ¿Ok? Entonces, yo, yo solo puedo contestar así, Carlos. I go to the movies. O puedo 
estar I like, pero este verbo ya le voy a poner ING porque usé el verbo like. ¿Ok? Going. Uh -huh. Exactly. I like going. Going to the movie. Movies. Uh -huh. O solo puedo decir I go I y no guess. me complico. All right? Yes. Yes. La, les explico esto porque a veces uno tiende a decir I like. Uh -huh. Me gusta. I like. Ajá. Uh -huh. So, you can say I like, but we have to follow some rules. Que ya las, ya las vimos en clases anteriores, ya, ya lo, lo, lo analizamos. Okay, so, this question, please take a picture to this question. Okay. Yes. What do you do in your free time? What do you do in your free time? It, it, is, it is very, the question is very easy. Now, I'm going to stop the share. And what we're going to do in this moment is we will go to a small rooms y vamos a preguntar uno cada uno. All right? For example, imagínense yo estoy trabajando con Maddie and Carmina. All right. So, let me see. Maddie, what do you do in your free time? Solo una oración, deme. Una nada más para fines de práctica. All right. I watch TV. Okay. Now, Maddie, you ask the question to Carmina. And Carmina, what do you do in your free time? I go to bed. Okay. Ah, really? <laughs> <laughs> so nice. Yes. All right. Now, Carmina, you ask. Uh, teacher, what do you do in your free time? I listen to rock music. Wow. Very nice. Hey, what do you do in your free time? Y así vamos a ir. Okay? Is it clear? Okay. In yes, order, yes. in order, in order. Para practicar. Ah, sorry. Yo sé que podemos decir, I like, eh, sorry, I read books, I listen to music, I watch TV. Podemos decir todo de un solo, all right? But to practice more the question, so we, like, memorize the question, we're going to do it like that. Okay, so we're going to go and practice. Let me see. Okay, it's okay, we're gonna create the rooms. And we're gonna <laughs> practice right now. Let's go everybody. Bye bye. <laughs> you have the invitation there to, to join the, the room. Mario, are you there? Sí, teacher, estaba teniendo problemas con mi inter, no sé qué pasó. De veras, bueno, voy a sí. asignar a un room ahorita, vamos a ver. Here. Gracias. Tal vez le aparece la invitation. Sí. Sí, 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 sí. Ok. Ay. Allí creo que algo más o menos se ve, ¿verdad? Sí, 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 sí. Va, en, va, entonces, usted a mí, pregúntele a Javier. Javier, Javier. Sí, correcto. Javier, what do you do in your free time? I like watch TV. Right, yeah. Se le escucha cortado, Javier. Así oí yo también. Uh, Maybe having problems with the internet. Um, podría ser. Uh -huh. eh, sí. Me Gustavo. Gustavo. Sí. Ok, dígame. What do you do yo. in your free time? I watch TV. And I listen to music. 
Okay. Abigail, okay. What, mm -hmm. what do you do in your free time? I go to the shopping. Okay. Shopping. <laughs> Excellent. Shopping. Yeah. <laughs> Javier. Mm -hmm. What do you, you uh, what do you do in your free time? Uh, I spend time with the family. And what, what do you do in your free time? I go go with free. Edgar, what do you do in your free time? I like going shopping. Uh, what do you do in your free time? I listen to music. Voy a aprender bastante, sí. Ah. Ok. Eh, Madi, what do you do in your free time? Mm, I like watching soap operas. Okay. <laughs> Carla, what do you do in your free time? Um, I, I like to play in parties. Parches, parches. Parches, ah, sí, sí. Okay. Sandrita, what do you do in your free time? I like, I like play. Playing. And playing, playing, playing an instrument. Mm -hmm. There you go. Sorry, Marie, se cortó. <laughs> okay, everybody. Okay, well, uh, right now we will go to the next activity and the next, next activity is watching a video. Okay, where's the video? It's here. All right, now we're gonna learn today. Hoy vamos a aprender or we're gonna learn today how to make invitations. Como invitar a alguien in English. Woo, all right, very good. <laughs> How to invite someone, yeah, to do different activities. For example, to go to the beach, to go to the movies, to go dancing. After the, the quarantine, after the quarantine, of course, because in this moment, it's not possible. So please, pay attention to the conversation. Take notes if it is possible for you, okay? And after that, you can ask me questions. Let's go. In this lesson, participants would listen to a conversation where wood for invitations is used when making plans. We will learn through this conversation how to accept or refuse an invitation. As you listen to the audio program, pay attention to expressions such as I'd like to and I'd love to. An invitation. I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. I'd love to. What time does it start? At 8 o'clock. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at 6? Uh, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match, around 7.30. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. Did you listen to the pronunciation? See you there. Did you listen? <laughs> yes. Ah, it is a very picky pronunciation. Usted va a ir adoptando su pronunciación en inglés. Pero lo que hay que hacer un poquito es como a little bit to pretend. All right? Is it clear? Uh, yeah. Yes, teacher, Sandrita. Uh, teacher, I don't understand. Uh, there. See you there. There. Ah, see you there. Te veo después. Ahí sería see you later. Ajá, uh -huh, see you there. Te veo, des te veo allá. See you there. Ah. How do you write? 
Oh, I'm going to I'm going to show you again the conversation. Let's yeah. just meet at the stadium before the match. Oh, okay, See you there. Okay, okay. Okay, thanks teacher. Okay, do you do you want to listen again or is clear? Uh, listen it's again. Clear. It's okay. We're gonna listen again. Yeah, no problem. We, we can listen again, but but the listening only. Okay. Accept or refuse an invitation. As you listen to the audio program, pay attention to expressions such as "I'd like to" and "I love to." An invitation. I have tickets to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. I'd love to. What time does it start? At eight o'clock. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at six? Uh, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. Okay, very good. Now, if you pay the attention. Hi, guys. Hi, good evening. Hi, Katia. Hi, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know why we are listening to her. Let me see. Okay. Now, um, did you pay attention to... Sorry, everybody. Hi, guys. Good evening. Hi. Okay, let me... Let me do this again here. Okay. Now, if you pay attention, what questions, what questions can we use for invitating someone? Good. Would you, like to, would you like to? Would you like? Yes, excellent. Would you like to? Would you like to? And another question? Do you want to have dinner? Yeah. Do you want to? Do you want to? That is another way. Form to ask. And another? Hay otra más. There's another, another what expression does, for invitation. What time does it start? So maybe here it would be will. No, that not way? that one. Okay, look at look at me and imagine the expression in English. Do you there? No. Okay, I'm gonna tell you. Let's, let's, go. Meet. Let's, let's go let's meet very good all right very good so these are the expressions that we can use for invitating someone okay i'm gonna stop the share here and we're gonna go hey i have full house today i have a lot of students today i'm happy for that okay very good now um these are are the three questions that we can use when we invite someone okay question number one y la más formal number one is the most formal do you like to okay yep Bye. for example maddie would you like to go to 40 y 20 with me uh, yes i would like it's correct? Yeah, that's correct. Yes, I would like to, or yes, only yes, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, that is the first question. The second question is la más normal, la más común, all right? It's the most common. It is, do you want to? Do you want to? Yeah, for example, um, Carlos, do you want to go to eat sushi with me? <laughs> Carlos, if yes. you pay, <laughs> so Carlos, do you want to do you do you want to go to eat sushi with me? <laughs> or no? Me 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 to go, teacher. <laughs> So, okay, Mario, okay. So I, will, I, I will go with you. <laughs> okay. May I to go? Yeah. Okay. So, the second question, do you want to? Esa pregunta la vamos a contestar, yes, I do or no, I don't. Okay? Don't, don't, don't complicate your life. You can say only yes or no. Okay. And number three, number three, esa ya es una invitación directa. 
No es ni pregunta. It is not a question. Number three, it is not a question. Each. Number three is only, hey, yes, let's I go expression. to, all right? All right. So, Carlos. <laughs> yes. Let's go. What? Hey, let's go. Let's go to eat sushi together. <laughs> you and me. Okay, let's go. Okay. Okay, Carlos, no quiere ir conmigo. He doesn't want to go out with me. <laughs> okay, so, are the three questions correct? ¿Están claras las tres preguntas? Yes. ¿Están difíciles? Yes, are they difficult? No. Oh, they are not difficult, right? They are not difficult. Okay, y aquí tenemos unos ejemplos. For example, would you like to go to the beach with me? Do you want to go to the beach with me? Hey, let's go to the beach together. Together, juntos. Let's go to the beach together. Okay. Let's go. Take a picture, please. No. Yes, teacher. Go, no, teacher. Huh? Yes. No, 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 no. Take a picture. Don? So Don? What do you like to um, Okay. Now we're gonna go to the next slide. Esta creo que se, esa se las mandé al grupo. Okay. I sent this to the group. Uh, let me check if you investigated the expressions in Spanish. Let's see. This is an exam. All right. Very good. What oh. of go hiking? Go hiking. What's the meaning of go hiking? Go hiking. Escalar. Okay, in Espanol. What's the meaning in Spanish? Escalar. Eh, ir a hacer senderismo. Senderismo. Go hiking. All right. Like what about go to a movie? It's clear. Yes? yes? Yes, it's clear. What about have lunch? Almorzar. Almorzar. Have dinner? Cenar. Cenar. A walk. Caminar. Exactly. O ir a dar un paseíto, right? Make a sand castle. Sand. Hacer castillo de arena. Okay, very good. What about go to the park? You know, right? Go to the park. Come to my party. Ir a fiesta. Ir a mi fiesta. Ven a mi fiesta. Jugar juegos de video. Jugar juegos de video. Exactly. Very good. Going shopping. Jugar basketball. Jugar basketball. Baseball. Oh, baseball. Baseball. Baseball is baseball. Softball. Volleyball. Volleyball. Yeah, come to picnic. Picnic. Is the picnic? Oh, what about this one? Come to my farewell party. Go to my farewell. Medida. ¿Cuál es? ¿Cuál es? ¿Cuál es el mínimo? Come to, oh, come, oh, ir a mi fiesta de despedida. Ok, come to my... What about... Okay, come to my... Yeah, right, but in El Salvador it's not possible. What about hang out this weekend? Hang out this weekend. Como salir a pasear este fin de semana, right? Teacher, I don't listen. Go skiing. What is the meaning? Ir, ir a esquiar. Go skiing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then we have go ice skating. But in El Salvador, it's not possible. Uh, so let's skiing. Patinar sobre hielo. Exactly. Patinar sobre hielo. But in El Salvador, it's not possible. Or yes. Yeah, yes, en galerías, a veces en galerías. Había una pista, <laughs> había really? una pista de hielo. Sí. That's nice. Aquí en, en Salvador, pero con cartones en la tierra, right? 
en la grama, en las montañas. Remember Plaza Alegre. Y yes. Yes. Well, Maddie, I love is you, Plaza the, uh, Maddie is from the new generation. She doesn't remember. <laughs> oh, el saburo irao. Saburo irao, too. Oh, los. El teleférico. Yes. Jardines. Yes. <laughs> exactly. Okay. The next one is come to my come pizza to my party. Pizza. Come to my pizza party. The next one is uh, uh, go to the lake, el lago, go to the lake. And the last one is go to the festival. Yes. All right. ¿Qué vamos a hacer en la práctica? Very easy. You will ask a question with any of these expressions. For example, let me see, I'm going to look. Laurita, are you here? Yes. Okay, Laurita is here. Laura, would you like to, voy a usar la primera pregunta, would you like to have dinner with me? Yes, I like. Yeah, ok. Les voy a dar las respuestas porque, bueno, esas las, las iba a explicar después, pero para que las, las podamos usar ahorita. Podemos usar esta respuesta. Yes, I'd, vamos a hacer la diferencia con la de, d, I'd. Yes, I'd like no. it. Like it. Pronunciación, acuérdese de aquella canción. Wait, uh -huh, uh -huh, I like it. Uh -huh. <laughs> That song? I like yeah. it. That's the way. Like uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. All right? I like it. Yeah. yeah. La yes? Yeah. Eh, I es contracción de I do. Oh. I would. I would. Ahorita lo escribo. Ahorita se los voy a escribir en un like. color diferente. Es como decir, yes, I would like it. Exactly, right. very good. No sé quién lo dijo. ¿Quién lo dijo? Usted. Mario Granado. <laughs> Bravo. <laughs> like if you say, I would. Yeah. I would like it. Exactly, I would like it. So look at like contraction. Remember that Americans, Americans love to use contractions. Diferente a los británicos. Británicos hablan el inglés formal, ¿ok? Ellos, ellos hablan así como, Yes, I would like to go over there with my friends and my partners. Or right, that's the way to speak, right? I but American English? <laughs> Sorry? I want, a water. I want a lot of water. I would like to drink some water. Yeah, good. <laughs> yeah, so uh, those are fish people, but Americans, they love contraction. Clear? Okay. Yes. Entonces, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Vamos a practicar estas preguntas. Sorry. <clears throat> Practice these questions. All right. Would you like to? And do you want to? With your partners. Is it clear? Yes. Okay. okay. Eh, Tienen la foto de esta? Se las mando al grupo. Do you remember? Si no, tómele una foto ahorita. Take a picture right now. That's okay? Yes. Yeah, very good. Okay. We're going to stop the chair and we're going to go and practice. All right? Very good. We're going to go and practice. Let me see. I have the group. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Se me quedó la canción. Let's go, everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs> Practice.
Patricia, are you there? Go, go, you like to go a movies? Uh, for example, you can say, would you like to go hiking or hiking? With the example that the teacher give us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Y ahí, ahí le vamos a, a contestar, yes, I, I then like it. Maybe the answer that the teacher give us, for example, I like it. Yes. Good. Uh. Would you like to go to the beach with your family? Yes, I, I, yes, I don't like it. Oh, I'd like it. I, I? Oh, look, look at me, look at me. Okay. I'd like it. I? I'd? I'd like it. Okay, I like it. I'd like it. I'd like it. I'd like it. Uh, Va a sacar la y... lengua. Uh, I. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I. Uh, do... uh, sería la otra una. Do you do you want to 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 have lunch? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. Do you want to take a Mm, yes, I like it. No, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Carmen Reyes. Hola. Uh, do you want to come to my party? Yes, I like. I like go. I'd, yes, I'd like it. I like it. I'd. Así enseña, enseñando la lengua. I'd. I'd like it. I'd like it. Like it. Yeah. Okay. Hey, okay. the two Carmens are here. Yes. <laughs> sí. Carmen Irene. Ah, okay. Carmen Irene and Carmen Reyes. Okay. Okay, no sé continue. Yeah. Les toca, se dice name, ¿se nombre? Name fake. Name fake. Como el, se escribe sake, como el, el, la bebida japonesa, pero se pronuncia name fake. No, fake. Name fake. O sea, Carmen and Carmen, they, they, are, they have the, the same name. They are name fakes. <laughs> Uh, uh, name <laughs> okay. okay, continue. Continue. Okay. Boris, do you want to come to my pizza party? Yes. Let's go to come to my farewell party. What? Let's go to come to my farewell party. The fiesta de despedida, creo que significaba. That's that's the that's the that's the word. Sí. Yeah. Ajá, entonces y la respuesta sería I would like it. Ajá, uh -huh, very good. I would like mm -hmm. it. No, but in this case, eh, Javier, usted no les estaba preguntando, sino que de una vez los está invitando porque le dice Let's go. Ah, sí. Ah, hey, let's go. Like? Y en este caso la respuesta, teacher, sería yo solo. Lo dicen yes. Okay, okay, okay let's go. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. okay. <laughs> let's cualquiera, go de, obligado. cualquiera de estas dos respuestas es para la formal y la, la uh -huh. pregunta informal, formal y la media informal. Exactly. Yes, I like it y I would like it. 
si quiero decir yes, no. Yes, I do. Or yes, I do. Y si quiero decir no, no, I would thank like. Thank you. Ah, uh, thank you. Uh, thanks. To the beach. Mm -hmm. No, thank you. I have to go to the doctor. Yes. <laughs> Okay, continue, continue. Okay, sí. What do you like? What? Stan, eh, Stanley me lo dejaron solito. Sí, no sé qué pasó. Oh, my I'm sorry. God. Creo que se le fue al internet quizás hoy. Ah, okay. I'm, I'm sorry, teacher. Don't worry, Santos. I understand, okay? I understand. Sorry, Stanley. Lo vi, lo vi solito ahí. Oh, my God, so... Okay, very good, everybody. Is it easy or difficult? Easy. So, so, vaya, vamos a seguir aprendiendo, okay? We're going to continue practicing. Vamos teacher, a aprender, yeah? mm, a question. Yes. I'm sorry, teacher, por, por cuestiones de la profesión. Yo sé. No voy enlazando, disculpe. Yo sé. Teacher, ¿puede okay. poner las, pre las preguntas nuevamente, por favor, para yes. tomarle foto? Yes, Carlita. I'm gonna, I'm gonna display them right now. Ok. Ahorita voy, Carlita, y me acerco. Here, ok. Santos, también yes. puede tomar foto. You can take a Thank you. Una pregunta, Tita. Eh, Edgar, do you have, ah, Samuel, do you have a question? Uh, en, cuan, en cuanto a las respuestas, eh, depende con qué se pregunta, si se va a contestar, va con, con Sí, tu... ahorita vamos a aprender las respuestas, ¿ok? okay. Ahorita okay. los quería tirar al agua para que me okay. en medio así y ahora ya vamos a nadar, ¿ok? Right? <risa> yes, okay. es para que se familiarice, que es familiar, ¿ok? Right? Now, I'm going to show you a video. and informal answers, pero lo común de contestar es yes or no, ¿ok? Yeah, we can answer only yes or only no, but right now we are learning the formal way. I'm going to show you the next video. Ahorita vamos a aprender la estructura ya formal para aceptar, to accept invitations or to Refuse invitations, okay? I'm gonna play the video. If you want, please take notes. Siempre es, es, it is important to have a notebook. Okay, I'm gonna play it now. We need to follow this structure. At the end of this lesson, participants will comprehend the use of word in questions and answers. Remember I told you last class to pay attention to the conversation when they used I like to or I love to? Well, now it's our turn to study how to form a sentence for accepting and refusing an invitation. Let's check it out. Would. Verb plus to plus verb. Would you like to go out on Friday? Yes, I would. Yes, I'd love to. Thanks. Yes. I'd really like to go. Would you like to go to a soccer match? I'd like to, but I have to work late. I'd like to, but I need to save money. I'd like to, but I want to visit my parents. Contraction. I'd equals I would. In order to accept an invitation, we need to follow the structure. Sub okay, so this structure is for accepting the invitation, okay? Object plus word plus verb plus to plus verb plus complement. Examples, I would like to go to her new house. I would love to go to her new house. Okay, so these are like the complete answers, all right? So for example, imagine if, if, if um, someone invites me. Teacher, would you like to go to eat sushi with me? Yes, I would like to go to eat sushi with you. All right, I can answer in that way. Or I can say, yes, 
I'd like it. Or yes, I'd love it. Okay, very good. Uh, now let's continue. And when we need to refuse an invitation. Refuse is rechazar, all right? Okay. We need to follow this structure. Subject plus word plus verb plus two plus verb, comma, but plus. Examples, I would love to go to her new house, but I can't. I would like to go to her new house, but I can't. House, but I can't. Sorry. I'd like to go to her new house, but I can't. Okay. Hi. <laughs> I would like to go to her new... Stop, stop, stop. Okay, now in here, we have the sentence to refuse invitations, for example. Teacher, would you like to go to eat sushi with me? I would love to go. Esto es como lo formal para agradecer, all right? I would love to go to eat sushi with you. Y aquí viene la patada, right? Mm -hmm. But I can't. All right? No puedo. No. Pero no puedo. O sea, es, es lo más no, es lo más polite de decir no. Okay? No. Here? <laughs> yeah, teacher, would you like teacher. to go to it? Yes? Teacher, y se podría entender como como a mí me encantaría, pero no puedo. Exacto, exacto, muy bien. Very good. Así se tiene que entender. Me encantaría, pero no puedo. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, se oye feo. Vaya, le quiero decir algo en español. A veces uno piensa que el inglés o que usar frases en español, en inglés, se va a sentir igual y no se siente igual. Por ejemplo, imagínense, yo les hago una pregunta. Ok, everybody, would you like to go to eat sushi with me? Y ustedes no me entienden. ¿Qué es lo más común que uno pregunta en español? ¿El qué? ¿Yes or no? Yeah. En inglés, si usted usa el what, se oye pesado. All right? Repeat, please. Exactly. Very good. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Can you repeat, please? Si hay un grado de confianza, hey, I don't understand. What did you say? All right? Pero si usted usa ese what, es súper tough. ¿Y es clear? Eh, una pregunta. Sí, yes, Santos. Eh, y si el verbo to be, eh, yo me gusta escuchar eh, mucho la, las noticias hmm. más de, de Trump. <ríe> bueno, y, y las noticias de medicina y, y el verbo to be casi ni lo utilizan casi. Yeah, ellos usan muchas contractions, all right? Contractions, eh, sí. Yeah, they use a lot of contractions. But in this case, esto es como lo más formal de... Okay? <laughs> Very good. So, is it clear? Yes, yes teacher. Sí. Solo tengo una yes. pregunta más, teacher. Yes, Carmina. Podría, right. bueno... Por ejemplo, ahí dice, I love to go to... to ta, 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 ta. Pero puedo decir solamente, yes, I love to, but I can, por ejemplo. Ahorita, sin decir... Ahorita vamos eh, a ver eso. Okay. Carmina, yes, yes. Aquí está. Uh, it is here, ¿ok? Carmina, everybody, right? Yes. yes, Carmina, you can make things short. You can make things short. For example. Okay. I'd like to go to my birthday party. Sure. Thanks. Cuando? When? Sure. Thanks. When? All right. Very good. So here. Would you like to go to my house? Carmina, would you like to come to my house? Yes, I love to. Ok, pero lo vamos a decir así. Me voy a acercar aquí, me va a ver la gran nariz, pero I'm sorry. I'd. 
Ah, item I, noun. Necesita hacer esto, I'd. I'd. Si usted dice I, I'd. está diciendo el I normal. Mm -hmm. You have to say I'd. The I and I'd. would contraction. Yeah. Is clear? Yes, I'd. I'd. Everybody, is it clear? Yes, sir. Yes, all right. Yo sé, este grupo me encanta porque si ustedes tienen una duda, siempre me preguntan. And that's, and that's very nice. All right. So here we have some questions, some, some options. Okay? ¿Qué podemos contestar? What are the possible answers? For accepting an invitation. Yes, I'd love to. O en vez de love, podemos usar like. Yes, I'd love to. Yes, I'd like to. Sure. Thanks. Yes, I'd like it. Mm -hmm. For refusing, para rechazar, for refusing. No, thank you. Sorry, it's not possible. I'm afraid, me temo. Uh, sorry, here is an apostrophe. There is a little mistake. I'm afraid I can't. Me temo que no puedo. Is it clear? Yes. Yes. Okay. So please, everybody, take a picture porque vamos a la última práctica. We're going to the last practice. Okay. So, Mario Granado. Hola. Ask me a, o oh, hágame una invitación. May, uh, make an invitation to me, please. No, it's good. <laughs> Okay, ask me a question. Okay, would you like to go to go to the movies? With me? Yes. With me. Whoa, um I'm afraid I can't, Mario. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Did you leave? Okay, ¿Verdad que aunque fue bien formal, pero se siente? Ruth, Ruth, I can't you can my party? Sorry, Santos. Santos, did you ask me a question? Ruth, uh, I can you my party? Oh, do you want to? Or would you like to? Um, Ruth, uh, you, yes. you would you, would you, would you like would you to? My party? Oh, would you like to come? Repeat, Santos, repeat. Sin uh, pena. Would you uh, like to come to my party? Uh, would you like? Ruth, go. Oh, I th there are problems yeah. with internet, I think. Okay. Would but you like to go to... To my party? Sure, thanks. Sure, when? A donde, <laughs> where? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ok, I'm gonna, we're gonna go, vamos a ir a practicar los últimos minutitos, esto en los grupitos, all right? We're gonna go and practice, let's see, and bye bye everybody. Sorry, 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 because I didn't change the time. I have a question. Yes? Uh, in, the, in, the, in the question, uh, would you like to go have a dinner is correct? Would you like go to... Would you like go, have? Would you like would you like have? To have. No. To okay. have. Go to have a dinner. Yeah, with me. Okay. Yes, that's correct. Thanks. Thanks okay. Teacher. Okay, everybody, let's go.
No, thank, thank, no, thank you. <laughs> Qué cortante. <laughs> My God. <laughs> Would you like to? Let me see. Would you like to go to the movies with me? Yes, I like it. I like it. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, would you like to go to shopping with me? Um, I'm sorry, it's not possible. Mm. I love. Uh, sure, and uh, ten son como dos respuestas por aparte. ¿Cómo se lo puede decir? Solo sure, que sure, ten es como, es como bien corta y bien informal, ¿verdad? Como, Ajá. Seguro. Ah, no, pero no. quizás Carmen lo dice porque yes, I eat, love it too. Hasta ahí sería la primera respuesta. Uh -huh. Yes, I love to, hasta ahí. No, es como... Sure, es ya, ya, ya de otra forma de responder. Uh -huh. Ok. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sure, thanks. Esas las pueden unir. Sure, thanks. Seguro. Ok, teacher, pero entonces la, le podría hacer una como yes, I'd love to. Hasta ahí nomás. Ah, ok. Yes, uh, okay. I'd love to. Yes, I'd love to. Yes, I'd love to. Sure, thanks. Sería como sure, otra, otra respuesta. Esa es otra. Sure, thanks. Mm -hmm. Yes, I like it. Yeah. Ay. Oh, okay. Ay, ay. Excellent, excellent, good. Okay. Carmen Irene. Wood. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Would you like to play soccer? Party. And yes, I like it. Oh, tú, Pati. Oh, yo creo. And would you like, would you like to go to a concert? Yes, I thank you. Okay. Okay, everybody. Well, eh, we're going to finish for today. Si tienen alguna pregunta, le voy a mandar el video de esta clase mañana. All right? Okay. Right. Eh, sí, teacher. Eh, Carlos. Puede mandar eh, los links a... Uh... Ah, Santos. Yes, yes. I'm going to send the links. Hoy les mandé dos. From, the yes, from yesterday's class and the day before yesterday. Ya? Yeah? Thank you very much. Yes, ok. Tratemos de trabajar en la plataforma. Deberíamos de ir ya por la sección 4. Section number 4. All right. Esta semana que viene terminamos. La semana que viene terminamos. Ya, no nos, vamos, ya nos vamos a ver. ¿Me perdón? Ya no nos vamos a ver, le digo. No, I, no sé. I don't know. Yo creo que les pasan una encuesta al final. Teacher, teacher lo, lo va a llevar no, seguimiento. A mí nunca sí. me ha pasado esa encuesta, teacher. Really? En el otro módulo le queremos a usted. Ay, so sí, nice. Sí, Thank sí, you so much. Sí. Sí. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Vamos a recoger firmas. Maybe, maybe, maybe you can. Uh, well, I, I, I honestly don't know the, the dynamic, but. I'm gonna My ask. beautiful okay. lady. Okay, thank you. All right. Yes. Ah, Samuel. Yes, Samuel. ¿Cuánto, ¿Cuántos módulos son para ese pre-intermedio? El para el pre-intermedio son seis, creo yo. Ah, pues ya vamos a terminar dos. Llevamos apenas. Mm -hmm. Pre-intermedio uno. Ya van a pasar al pre-intermedio pre two. Pero es bonito, fíjense, porque puede practicar. Se puede. Si uno quiere, puede. Mm -hmm. ¿Ok? Uno quiere, puede. Y gracias a Dios, pues ustedes son un grupo bastante...
bonito, constant. Know that maybe some of you have problems for your job or the time. <laughs> Esto es un sacrificio, pero vale la pena al final. Okay? Yeah. So, yeah. thank you very much, everybody. And if you yeah. have a question, Bye. text me, Bye. the group. Bye. Bye. Okay. Bye. 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 Bye, Laura. Bye, Bye everybody. Goodbye. Have a good night. Good Have a night. good night. Bye.